Hi there guys, it's Nina here, hope everyone is good. So, if you saw my last video, you would have seen my Bayi Makari haul, um, slash just general photo card haul in which I kind of began my photo card collection. I say began, I already had a fair, a, an okay amount of photo cards already, but this was like by far the biggest um, dive into the photo card world that I've ever gone to. So this video today is going to be me organising and putting away the photo cards that I received from Bai, eBay, Depop, um, the various places that I ordered from. So I currently have three binders. I've only got two on display. I do have a third one. So this purple one is my Yungi binder. Um, I just randomly just popped in the season's greetings photo because it's just really big and I don't have anywhere to store it. And I thought it would be nice on the front for now, mainly because I already have this binder. So this is my OT7 binder um, and I have the Tegi unit, so Tegi and Yungi um, on the cover. So I thought it would be nice if I put the Yungi one on the cover of my Yungi binder. And this is the Mot7 binder. So as I said in this one, I mainly just put OT7 cards, which there's not much. It's literally just like the Persona ones, my army kit and the notes, like genuinely. And some odd ones that I haven't organised yet. But besides that, it's an empty binder. Like my collection is not big. So I think I'm going to start with my Mots photo cards because I literally have a few to put away. And I'm going to come back to my Yungi binder in just a moment. I'm using my Mots photo card binder essentially as my official tour PC binder. However, I don't have all the tour PCs. Um, so my Yungi ones that I bought, like the Love Yourself Yungi tour PCs and the Japan version of those PCs, um, will be going in my Yungi binder. But this is currently Mots and Speak Yourself uh, tour PCs. In this binder, I have my Army Bomb PCs. Um, this is of course from the Army Bomb version 3, and then these are from the Map of the Soul Special Edition Army Bomb. So I'm just going to find my Mots PCs in the crowd so I can put them away. So there's some of them here, up until this one. So Namjoon is complete, completely complete. Um, I was lucky enough to pull all of the eight cards, so very happy about that. Okay, next we have Jin. So two Jin cards need to go away. Just gonna pull these out. And let's find my Jin cards. Here they are. So this one is four, which just goes here. And this one is obviously six, which goes there. Oh, there we go. And a complete map of the Soul Tour Jin collection. So next, Yungi. I was lucky enough to pull all of the Yungi cards. Um, actually, I traded a couple of them, but I pulled most of them. But next we have Hobie. Um, Hobie completed. I to totally pulled. Actually, I pulled and I think I traded for one. So happy about that. Next we have Jimin. So Jimin, oh, fun story. Um, I traded for Jimin seven out of eight and it's lost in the post. Um, I traded with someone from France. I don't usually trade um, for PCs with people out of the UK. However, uh, they didn't tell me they were from France until we finalised the trade. So I wasn't happy about that. And then the card got lost. So I just bought an extra one on um, Depop and six, which goes there. So now Jimin is complete. Over the moon. Next, Tay. So only one Tay card, which is four out of eight, which is just here. This one was so hard to find, like... Not many people were selling this and every time I found someone, it was impossible to trade. So I had to buy these. Um, luckily, I only bought the, these cards from um, two sellers. So I was able to get like a decent like discount on them. But it's really annoying because I really wanted to trade them. But I had to purchase the last few. But here is Tay Complete. And then next, 
JK, last one. Oh, so satisfying to complete. Just turning over the OT7 page, was able to complete these all with trades, so it was over the moon about that. While I'm showing you this binder, I might as well just show you um, my Speak Yourself final um, PCs. If any of you have been subscribed for a while, you would have seen that I was in Seoul last year around the time of the Speak Yourself final, and I picked up all of the um, photo cards from the concert, from the merch booth. Oh, may I just tell you guys, the photo cards are so cheap in Korea. Like, it's literally £3 for the pack of photo cards. So I bought all eight and I traded. So all of these are from trades. Um, however, I purchased one Jin card a while ago to complete his set. And I never managed to complete Tay and JK. But this is my Speak Yourself final. So we got Namjoon, Sokjin. Yungi, obviously, of course, he was the first one I was able to complete at the concert. We were trading outside the stadium. And then Hobie. Funny story, I accidentally sold this card because I thought I had a dupe of it and I didn't. So I just sold it and I didn't notice for a year nearly. But I was able to get another one for my friend who had a spare, which was so lucky because I'm a joke for doing that. Um, Jimin's complete set and as I said Tay missing three if anyone has speak yourself final cards and would like to sell them to me hit me up um, and JK I'm missing four um, I was kind of stupid and didn't realize how difficult it would be to trade for JK and Tay so when I was at the concert I traded for the easiest one so I traded for Yoongi first and I essentially traded for Hyung Line but Hyung Line are the easier ones to get, so I should have spent all of my time trading for Magne Line and then come back to Hyung Line later, but we all make mistakes. And at the back of this binder, I have the OT7 or the unit photos. There was only six for the Speaker Soft final, which is annoying. Like, they could have just had two more. Um, and at the back, these are all of my album pulls, but as I said in my previous video um, of my photo card haul, I kind of want to sell all of my album pools because I purchased so many Yoongi cards that it's just not justifiable for me personally to have the album pools if um, they're not my bias and the amount of money I've spent. I think it's just easier if I just sell these. I don't think I'll ever sell this Namjoon card because I am obsessed with it. But I still have all of my tier. Um, I'm missing... Um, sorry, that wasn't tier, that was her. This is tier. I'm missing my tier... Um, o for JK because I sold it and all of these answers, um, the E, L and F I sold, they were JK and I needed to um, get rid of them and people were looking so I sold those and these are my persona pools, um, two Jins, Jimin and JK and these are obviously the Mot7 pools because there was no OT, uh, sorry there was no unit not unit, no solo member um, photo cards in the UK. So obviously everyone got group PCs and that is it. There's only a couple pages spare in this binder. So yeah, that is my OT7 tour binder. And it's now complete. Awesome. So that is done. <sighs> Time to put this away. And now onto my Yungi binder. Now... This binder is very temporary because I bought this from Amazon America, Amazon.com, um, and I accidentally, like, slightly damaged it, and it's not really opening that well. It's also too big. It's two inches, and it's too big for just Yungi. So I repurchased another purple one, which is one inch, which will be perfect for Yungi. But, um, yeah, it's pretty boring because, as I said... I just started my collection and I hadn't put anything away in it. I was waiting for this massive pa uh, parcel to come before I started to put away my photo cards. But while I was waiting a long time for everything to arrive, I made these little inserts. So these are just inserts with washi tape at the front. So I can just tape, uh, take off the washi tape and put a new bit of washi tape on. So these won't be getting wasted, but I made a lot of them. 
Now, because there's so many album PCs to put away and it's going to take ages, I think I'm going to start with these bigger PCs. So I'm going to take out the Love Yourself Tour. This is going to be Love Yourself Tour Japan. And this is the Magic Shop Japan. So just moving those. Okay, so in this pile here, I'm going to take out the bigger ones. So, oh, I forgot to get a sleeve for Bang Bang Con. I need to do that. But let's just take out all the big PCs. Cool, I'm going to leave that there for a second. So let's start off with the Love Yourself Tour photo cards. So as I said, I purchased a set that was OT7. Not OT7. I purchased a set that had seven of Yungi's cards. Um, and I had to buy the one that was missing on Depop. However, I already had one that I won on eBay a really long time ago before I was even intending on like going crazy with collecting. So I just thought, let me get this because it was literally like three pounds, but now I have a dupe. So I will be selling the duplicate card, but this one is of course one of eight. Wow, 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 Nina, I'm doing great. So one of eight and then Two of eight. So difficult to slide these in. And I think I'm going to keep this original three of eight since it's already there. The three of eight that I have as a dupe, as I said, will be putting it probably on my Depop. Um, but I will just leave it aside for now. Actually, because I want to keep it safe, I'm going to put it behind this one. And then this should be four of eight. So let's just pop this just in here. Very struggle. And then five of eight. Six of eight. <laughs> the cards are flying everywhere while I'm trying to do this. And seven of eight. Come on, get in. And eight of eight, last but not least. Oh, exciting. And there we go. Love yourself, Tor. Yungi complete. Just going to put this underneath for now. Okay, so next is the Love Yourself Tour Japan. I put one there because I just couldn't be able to fill all of them as I knew I bought the set. So it's easier just to put one. So I knew where I was going to put it. But hopefully this should all be in order. Let's double check. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. So let's just put them straight in. So one, two, three, four, five. Come on now, come on now. There we go, six of eight, seven of eight, and final PC. It wants to go in. Last one, eight of eight. So a complete set of the Love Yourself Tour in Japan Yungi photo cards. Awesome. So next we have Muster. So I showed you some of the Fifth Muster Japan photo cards earlier on. Um, but the ones that were missing are already in my binder because I previously bought them. So because I bought three, annoyingly, I had to buy all of them separate, um, which probably ended up costing more than just buying the set. But I'm stupid. And it was when I was first buying. So I didn't really know what I was doing. Um, however, these cards are so gorgeous, but I really desperately want the Korean version of them. So... If anyone knows anyone selling, hit me up. However, let's pop these last five in. So this one is eight of eight. So you can see the from um, five to eight, there's a gray background. And these ones should be in order. <laughs> there are no particular order. So let's quickly order them. Cool. Okay. So one. Of eight, two of eight, three of eight, and finally four of eight. 
fantastic. So these are the only complete sets I have. Um, so as I said, Fifth Master Japan, Love Yourself in um, Japan and Love Yourself Korean version. So I am, um, actually I'm not gonna put them away just yet because I need to put away Bang Bang Con. So just grabbed another sleeve from my other binder just to start my Bang Bang Con. Um, I need to print some inserts for these or recycle some of my inserts because I have them coming from all over. I have a few coming from, a couple coming from America. I think one's coming from Japan and another one is in the post from God knows where. Um, somewhere in Europe so it's going to be a while so I'm going to put inserts in there after but this one is five that is four that is eight and that is two okay cool so two first and then four in fact I've already forgotten which number they are and it's been like five seconds I think this is five yeah, five of eight. And then this is definitely eight of eight. I actually think I have two eight of eights. I ordered these in a set from one seller and I also won an eBay auction, um, which was eight of eight, which is annoying. Um, so again, we'll be on my Depop when that arrives. Love having dupes. Let's go back to the beginning because oh, I have so many PCs to put away. Everything here is an album PC and everything here on my sleeves is empty. So there is a lot to put away. Weirdly enough, I have them in reverse order by accident. So let's start with Mott's and work our way back. So let's take out my inserts. I accidentally printed these ones on paper instead of cards, so they're kind of flimsy. Um, definitely recommend printing inserts on cards just so it's easier to take in and out. But let's pop them to the side. This one is version one. Does it want to go in? There we go. Oof, it's a bit hard to put in, isn't it? Because I have them upside down so that they are easier to take out. However, maybe I should have put them the other way. So I kind of, I have a couple of solutions. So I'm having issues putting them in because I really want to keep them in the sleeve. But for some reason, it's not staying in the sleeve. So I have a couple of solutions. One is to just put it in by itself, which I kind of want them to be extra protected. My second solution is, might not actually work, but I have these ultra pro kind of sleeve things, which are a little bit less flimsy and they're also lilac, but let's see if they fit in here. Oh, they do fit. Okay. I guess they're gonna, I didn't really want to use these because they have a hologram just there and it kind of bugs me, however, it's better than being in nothing. Okay, so to save you guys some time, I am going to put them in these sleeves um, off camera and then I'm gonna put them all in my binder together on camera just so that it doesn't take literally hours for me to put these away. So give me just a minute. Okay, so let's pop away the last one. So this is version two of Mott's seven. And then version three, I'm going to leave this blank because B is coming out soon. And um, the deluxe album comes with eight photo cards, which is just ridiculous. Um, and then there might be a regular version of the album. So God knows, but I'm going to leave all of these blank for B. But yes, here are Mot 7, 1 to 4. Okay, so let's get started on the next page which is answer to Mott's persona. So let's start with answer. It was a little bit extra that I took the time to do 
a placeholder for each of the cards when I literally was going to put all of them in together. But I had time. I had a lot of time. So first of all, we're going to start off with Persona. Wait, I'm doing this backwards. Am I? Am I okay? I'm not okay. <laughs> oh my God. Sorry guys, we're gonna start off with answer. So love yourself, answer, S. And then we have E, if it would like to go in. Perfect. And then we have L and then F spells self. Welcome to Nina's English class. It's bugging me that this is ever so slightly wonky. Like, ever so slightly. Okay, there we go. That's a little better. Cool, and then now let's put away Persona. Cool. So we have one, two, and then three. And then four. Ugh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I actually think it looks so much better with the um, these little Ultra Pro sleeves behind them. It's annoying that Ultra Pro has this. I mean, it's cool that they have like a what's it called hologram, but it it's a little bit annoying because you can see it. But hey, her and Tear are in the purple sleeves, so we're gonna take out the her placeholders first, pop them aside, and L, god this is so satisfying starting like to put these away for the very first time. The one thing that annoys me about these sleeves is that they just don't sit straight in them. Okay, oh the most gorgeous PC, like, in the history of PCs. So that is O. This is V. Yungi's iconic loved Gucci jumper from 2017. And I actually went to this place in Seoul. This pizza shop. And there we have, oh, I just realised I put them in the wrong order. But actually, no, it's fine because I'm going to I'm going to do something. I'm going to do something. I was supposed to start from here, but I just thought of something. I'm going to put the tear lenticular in the center. If I can find it. Yes. So I put this in the wrong order. However, it's perfect because the tear lenticular Lilla, can't speak English. The tear lenticular can go in the middle. Oh, that looks good. I think that's good, yeah. And then let's take out these and then put the tear photo cards in. So Y, O, B, oh, that's literally not even slightly straight. What is this mess? And then R. Oh. Perfect. I think that looks really good with the tear lenticular. I wish I had the her lenticular. I don't. But I think the tear one looks quite good in the middle just there. It's nice seeing a complete page. Actually, now that I've done that, I think I could put the answer one here. I think that would be good. So let's move these up one so that the answer one is in the centre, just like the tear. Ugh, imagine if I got my hands on the her holographic lenticular special photo card. That is the dream. Oh, oh my God. The struggle is real Z's. Cool. And then last one to go here. And then let's just grab the 
go to the card it's just in here i wonder if it will fit in the purple sleeve i don't think it will fit in this i think it's ever so slightly too big oh hmm it is a struggle it just fits i think i'm going to keep it in there even though you can't even see the purple see the only issue is this is ever so slightly too big it like it just comes out the top it's ever so slightly too big and i think putting it in the sleeve is not helping let's try taking this out of the sleeve and seeing how it is okay it's a little bit better out of the sleeve plus you couldn't really see the purple behind it anyway so i think i'm going to leave it like this cool that looks awesome okay so first page is a mixture so <laughs> there are some photo cards i don't have um but i do have the oh are you late too so let's take that out and put this in okay h y o h part two slots in there dope oh I really desperately am looking for the dope PC. But you never walk alone. I have just here. And these ones are currently blank um, because there just wasn't a way to fit them in. Um, I'm thinking I might temporarily put some of these here just because I don't like having gaps. And yes, I am going to be putting the BTS World photo card down here because there are three or four in total. Um, so they will be able to fill up the bottom. So let's put this one here for now. And I need to make placeholders for the other ones. So here we have HYH1. Um, Young Forever and Wings, which are obviously earlier. So let's move them towards the front. So at the end of this, I will be putting another nine pocket here because here will be my DVDs and miscellaneous cards. So I have got a Memories of 2017 um, DVD PC en route should be here in the next few days. So it will be going on this page, but for now it's gonna be random until I sort it out. But I'm just gonna put this fifth muster card here. I did see a fourth muster card on eBay, but it was a little bit pricey. So I'm gonna to wait to see if there's anyone else selling them. But let's just put this here just so it's not lonely. And I know this is super random, but for now, I'm going to put these Chilsun and Lemina cards. I'm going to randomly put these at the bottom just because um, I don't have anywhere to put them at the minute. And I don't know what to sort them with. So let's just put them here for now until I have some more PCs to organise them with. Cool. Oh, this lenticular is so cute. Okay. So pop that down there. It's a little bit uneven. Awesome. Okay, so just at the back of this, um, this is just super random and I'm thinking, oh, it does fit. Okay, cool. I thought it wasn't going to fit in one of these. So I'm just going to grab one more eight pocket and this is going to be my like miscellaneous eight pocket. And <laughs> it's currently only going to have one thing in it, which is this um passport what was it passport cover photo card i'm just going to put it here for now until i can fill it with so i think i'll probably put some random things in here like ring pcs 
uh, maybe the portable charger PCs. I'm going to try and grab um, some random PCs to fill this one with so it's not lonely. But yes, just pop that in here. So that is pretty much everything. Um, if you want to have a little look through my current photo card status, so we have these three and then love yourself. Oh, this makes me so happy. I despise how big this card is. Why? <laughs> Why is it so big? But yeah, we have answer and persona, mots with gaps for B, random collaboration PCs and muster. Um, of course, we have muster Japan. Oop. Then we have love yourself Japan, love yourself Korea. Bang Bang Con and random miscellaneous page. Okay, so that is my Yungi PC binder with all of my Yungi PCs away. Um, I have one set of PCs to put away in my OT7 binder. So I'm just gonna quickly do that now before ending the video. So this is my OT7 binder and the only photo cards I need to put away in here are the In The Soup PCs. So let's start in my order. So I always go in Fanchan order. So that means Namjoon is first. And then Jin. And then, oh, this isn't a completely random order. How did I shuffle them so much? Okay. And then Yungi. I love like pregnant Yungi pose. <laughs> If you know, you know. Cool. And then Hobie. I thought it was going in and it truly wasn't. Oh. Jimin. No, nope, you don't want to cooperate, Jimin. You don't want to go in, Jimin. There we go. Taehyung. Last but not least, JK. Now I'm just gonna ugh, lean it on the back of my folder so you can see them a bit better. But that is the OT7 in the soup photo cards. They are gorgeous. But because they don't fit in the little sleeves, they will be not so gorgeous at the minute. Actually, they don't look so bad with the notes behind. So I really do hope you enjoyed this video. If you do want updates about my photo card collection, um, you can follow me on my new collection account that I made on Instagram, which is just blueberry.myg. But yeah, please do give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Uh, please subscribe to my channel for BTS related content and just general K-pop fangirling if that is what you are into. Thank you again for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.